So now we have a question in which multiples are the 10 next to each other, the multiples of 7, they are the 10 one after the other and we have to find out the 20 20th digit. So there will be so many numbers, so many multiples of 7 that we'll have to write. Let's quickly see that how many multiples of 7 have one digit, how many multiples of 7 have two digits and so on. Because that is how we would like to reach to the 20 20th digit. So there is only one multiple of 7 which will have just one digit, right? Now, two digit multiples of 7. Two digit multiples of 7 start from 7 into 2, that means from 14 to, uh, you can go up to the 14th multiple, right? Because 14 into 7 is 98. So how many multiples do we have here? From second multiple to the 14th multiple, that means we have 13 multiples here. Now how exactly we are going to count the number of digits, here we have counted only one digit but here because every multiple has two digits therefore we are writing th 13 multiplied by 2 equal to 26 digits. Now so far we have counted 27 digits. Now let us see that how many multiples of 7 have 3 digits. So that how can we identify, quickly understand. Now I am dividing 1000 by 7. 1000 when divided by 7 gives us 142 point something if I am not wrong. Let me just quickly check. 73, 7, 7 4, 28. Yes, 142 point something something. That means we have 142 multiples of 7 from 1 to 1000. Till and out of these 142, we already have 14 multiples which are either single digit or two digit. That means 142 minus 14 which gives us 128 multiples we have of 7 which run into 3 digits. That means the total digits used here will be 128 multiplied by 3 so that will be 360 plus 24 which is 384 digits. So Let's understand that how many multiples, how many digits have we counted. We have counted one digit at first, then 26 digits and then 384 digits. If we add them all, then it becomes 411 digits so far. Now we have to reach to 20 20th digit. That means how many more digits do we need? 20 20 minus 411. Let me just do the addition once again. So 16 added here becomes 400. Yeah, it seems absolutely fine. So 2020 minus 411 basically gives us 1609. So we have to just count 1609 more digits. And they will all be in the, mul in the multiples of 7 which are running into the 4 digits. Now, every multiple of 7 after these 142 multiples will have 3 digits, will have 4 digits. So this 1609 must be divided by 4 because now we are reaching to that multiple that we want to count, right? So that will be equal to when 1609 is divided by 4, it is calculated as 402, right? So we have 402 multiples to count and then we will have one more digit left. That means 400 third multiple will give us the 220th digit and the 403rd multiple will have four digits and the leftmost digit in that case will be the 2020th digit here. So 402, 403rd multiple. Let's quickly calculate. So 403rd multiple we have to reach and we have uh, how many? 142 multiples beforehand which are running into either one digit or two digit or three digit. So the total multiples of seven that we need to consider should be equal to four, one, four, five, right? Oh, my mistake, 403 and 142 I am adding. So that becomes 545. So 545 multiplied by seven. Let's see what we get, 35, 31, 38 so we have 3 so 3 must be our answer because 2020th will be 3 i hope that helps thank you so much